Since daily exercise has become mandated by the government, I've been running and training almost every single day. It's made me feel fitter, happier and healthier. With the pandemic becoming endemic, I knew I needed to make a change. Welcome to 5K to Couch. I didn't have much money. I knew I wasn't going to have much free time, but I needed a clear structured plan to become intentionally sedentary. I haven't looked back since. The great thing about the 5K to Couch plan is it understands the mindset of someone who trains every day. It takes that mindset and it undermines it at every possible opportunity. The plan starts gradually, allowing you to maintain an active lifestyle and then slowly, little by little, it'll diminish your activity until you're virtually sedentary. Week one's a 5K run, but bookended with 12 hours of inactivity on either side. It's going to be a hard adjustment, but believe me, you can do it. Not training simple. I'm not training right now. Stop running now. I booked a video call with my GP to find out the health benefits. Dr. Robotnik, can you explain why the 5K to Couch programme is so good for my health? It isn't good for your health. It's one of the worst ideas I've come across in my medical career. It's likely to cause you lethargy, insomnia, stress, and in the long term, there could be serious health problems. OK, so why is 5K to Couch such an effective way to become more sedentary? What do you mean? Thanks, Doctor. Thanks to 5K to Couch, I've become an entirely different person. I'll admit I was sceptical, but if I can do it, so can you. So what are you waiting for? Piss off! I'm filming for TV. <laughs>